So in the previous video, we rebuilt the front end completely. And she's back on her new feet up here. Time to tackle the rear end. <laughs> Coming up. Hey, how's the jokes? <laughs> and welcome back to my forest workshop. As I stand here on the front bumper of my Rio Gold Comet truck. I think it's a 1959 model, but I'm not sure. Uh, my long-term plan is to turn this into a car hauler or a ramp truck. And today, we're doing some work on this again. How do you eat an elephant? One tiny bite at a time. This is my long-term project. So in between everything else, we take a bite at it. Big mess waiting for us here under the back. Axel, look at all this leaking and oil and stuff. Yeah, I'm going to cover it with some sawdust. Try and clean it up some. And then we can find out where this freaking leak is. I hope it's not a major issue. That we have to pull side shafts and stuff like that. I guess there's only one way to find out, eh? Alright, so the back end's going up. We've got to do the whole back axle and brakes and drums and the whole show. Alright. Gonna come off, yeah, here we go. Alright. Fantastico. Okay, then the next one. One down, one to go. Uh, the spacer, eh? Hey? Yeah, and it might be dirty in here and it might be a little bit. Yeah, oh, so it's, yeah. But Michael, we need a hammer and we just need a couple of... Let me get a hammer out. Oh, yeah, yeah. Get it off that one. Hello, Arrow. Mommy's you, new dog is coming to inspect. You can surely jump up. You must just sit here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Are you making a noise, man? Just record it, that's all. My neighbor Arnold, I want to say something. Give me a break. There we go, my neighbor Arnold also came to visit and now look, now he's working as well. So I'm just a cameraman now. <laughs> hey, it's coming loose. There we go, there we go. I wonder when the last time was that that thing was taken off, eh? Well done, boys! Woohoo! Here we go! Voila! Right. 
Okay, so the keyway is over there, right? Mm -hmm. Funny enough, it doesn't extend all the way. Mm -hmm. So you've got to put it out at an angle. Alright, so you get it there and oh. then you come and you lift it and out it comes. Good show, brother. Right. Then this bike behind it is also a nut. Special tool number 48. <laughs> Well, we were trying to drop it nicely and the camera wasn't on and now it's on the floor. <laughs> it didn't go as planned, but it's out. 
<laughs> Things are definitely not going as planned <laughs> because now we not only have rust and dust everywhere, we got oil everywhere as well as pouring out the side of the diff as we're trying to get it out from under the truck. Yeah. Throw some sawdust on there. Right. Oh yeah. Okay, right, let's give it a shot. Okay. Turn back. And turn, no, no, no. I want it to swing. So, oh. my side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you push. Your side. It'll work. Okay, now we're gonna drive through my bucket full of dirty oil. Okay, okay. <laughs> anyway, you come to the other side. It's getting, it's getting. Let's get it there. It's still pissing oil out the end, but it's fine. We'll clean up the mess just now. Well, at least your trolley is working. Well done on that. Poor little trolley. He's taking his train. This thing's heavy. Here we go. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> right. Now what? One, two, three. Here we go. Have a little fun. A little fun. As it falls, I'm going to let it fall. Huh? Or we can leave it. I'm going to let it fall. Huh? It moved. Did it? Yeah. Okay, wait, 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 wait. There we go. Oh. Okay. Heavy? Yeah, no, it's heavy. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Yeah. See if it'll move now? No. No, not yet. You're, you're against. You're against it. Well, you pull again and let me wiggle. And let's see if it works. Auto flip and spear them, huh? Check that. Okay, now you just don't go on there. You got it? Yeah. Voila! <laughs> okay. Right, that's it. <laughs> right, here we come. <laughs> what if I see mission? Still a lot of oil in there, eh? Yeah, I can't step over. Oh, yeah. You ready? Oh, you're right. Yeah. Oh. And turn it around, yes, yeah, so you show the camera. Yeah. Look at that. Right. Still looks good. Oh, no. This stuff was over full. Uh, got it. Wow. Give us a lever long enough and we'll move to Earth. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That's true. 
So I have a very strong feeling that that's the first time that in, what, 60 plus years, those nuts are being undone. That's actually quite tricky in the way, yeah? That is, yes. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Alright. Alright. We've got to make grunting noises, it helps. <laughs> Like they told us in karate. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Apparently, actually, what works is because you blow your air out. Yeah. Oh, is yeah. that actually? Yeah, that's actually the, 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 the what do you call it? The science behind it or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> See, it works. <laughs> uh, all right. All right, and then wait, wait. I can no, one get more. this one from this side. <laughs> <laughs> No, we're going to do that side still, yeah. Uh, Alright. I think that one's the last one, eh? I think it's the last one. Alright, yeah! There we go. So our little our tempo, uh, what do you call that thing? Impact wrench, that's the right name for it. Yes. It doesn't have the oomph to do that, eh? Right? Yeah. We once once it's to this point, then we've got to start it. And then once we get there, the impact drive will do it. Behind you. <laughs> there you go. That's it. Yeah, it should come off. Okay. There we go. Alright. Fantastic. Alright. So we took all the oil out and there was nothing strange in the oil. No, no bits and pieces, so that's a good sign. Yeah, oil was actually very clean. <laughs> yeah, oil was pretty good. Um, it's got a bit of sludge in here, but there's no particles in anything like that. So that's yeah. awesome. So I think let's just pressure wash the whole freaking thing. What do you reckon? I think it's a good plan. Get rid of it. I will yeah. actually maybe just wipe out the worst of this mess here. Yes, then we can put the... the Degreaser in? Yeah. Yeah. That should sort that out. Then she will be ready for a paint job, eh? Yep. Oh, I think. Uh, <laughs> what have I got here? 60 years full of yucky stuff. <laughs> <laughs> 60 years of deposit and sludge. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Alright, yeah.
I like it. I like it. So this freaking thing is so heavy. What do you call this thing? The, the differential gears. Crown wheel and pinion set. Crown wheel and pinion assembly. <laughs> or whatever. But this thing is freaking heavy. This so <laughs> crown wheel and that pinion. In the pinion. Well, there you go then. And we... the spider gears? The spider gears is inside. Yes, no, really. Inside there. Right. The spider gears crown wheel, pinion, the... spider gears for the side shaft. So after all that clarification of terms, <laughs> what I wanted to say is this freaking thing is so heavy. So we brought the diff housing, you call it the diff housing, in here, and we're going to actually now waste it with a block and tackle. <laughs> so diff has got a diff housing. Diff's got a diff housing. So this is what you call SOS. Uh, Slower, older, but smarter. There you go. Waste away. <laughs> Yeah, we know it's right. No, we figured that already. That's where the big wheel goes. This side's yellow, that Stop. side's yellow, right? That side's rusty, that side's rusty. Let's stop this is what Yes. Yes. And as we remember it, the this was lower. <laughs> Yeah, I reckon that's enough. So you've made a mess on my floor, Wayne. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not supposed to miss the cardboard, that's why it's there. Right, <laughs> right. Go. come. Okay. okay. I think that's probably close enough. Uh, you can tie it off. Take out your, uh, pick it up again. Take out your blocky there. Oh, yeah. Right. Okay. Throw it away. Up. Up. Yeah. Up. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Um, wiggle. Wiggle. Okay, lots of hands all over the place. <laughs> We're just tightening it down equally from all sides. Slowly but surely. Yeah. Wayne, are you sure we've put it in the right way around? <laughs> uh, I think there's actually only one way. <laughs> You've got a four speed reverse and one yeah. speed forward. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, you can. If you turn the crown and pinwheel around, it will go in reverse. One more nut. Yeah. Yeah, there's actually two, bro. I don't know where that one uh, goes, but uh, I need uh, one more. Okay. Right, then we want to see a little bit of sealer peel out all around it, and then we know it's sealed. There you go. So Wayne is just talking all these bolts now. <laughs> Highly scientific approach here. We're doing it, what are we doing? It? Two clicks of the left elbow? Yep. <laughs> yes, that will be perfect. Click, click. <laughs> click, click. <laughs> or should it rather be squeak, squeak? <laughs> or maybe Go for Aina. crunch crunch <laughs> so the boys here at spring techs going to sort out my spring for me i need new bushes we're gonna go through it maybe replace the center pins and one is the man he knows I'm what to man. do he's the man <laughs> What is your name? I'm Francois. Francois, yes, Francois. How's it, Francois? I'm, 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 I'm Mona's, I'm Mona's assistant. Yes, Mona's assistant, and there's another dude. What's your name? Shepard. Who feel? Shepard. 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 Oh, okay. Oops, it's heavy. Up, up, up. Right. 
So morning when I see them again, they're going to be all nice and pretty and lekker, eh? Yes. Okay? Yes. Awesome. Thanks, my brother. Okay. Right, let's see if my stuff is done. Let me in! Why? <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Andre. We must speak know. English because uh, otherwise people don't understand us. How's it going? Like we you. Is my okay, drum good. sorted? Yes, yes, yes. Fantastic. It started rusting again. Oh, wow, eh? <laughs> this looks like it was hard stuff, eh? Yeah, it was. Huh? It was hard indeed. Eh? Looks good, though. There we go. Show me the shiny side, man. I don't want to see the rusty side. <laughs> Lucky, man. Thanks a lot. Awesome stuff, thanks Bernard! Okay, lekker man, now my back rooms are also tonka toy yellow. <laughs> so about uh, 45 minutes later, and that stuff has now converted the rust into this blue-black foam. That has planted that surface, ready for painting. I'm going to let it dry for an hour or two longer. There we go, machined and painted and ready to rock. Whatever makes you happy, it just depends on you. So think a little bigger and dream what you could do. Oh man, what is wrong with me? Why am I doing this to myself? Ay, ay, ay. There is one exciting thing about cleaning up old parts, and that's when you discover the original markings. Look at that, DTA Company. I'm not sure what the A stands for now, I'll have to go and ask Dr. Google. <laughs> but DT must definitely be Diamond T. Just proof the Diamond T heritage of this truck. There's some interesting writing on this oil filler cap as well. So let's take that out so we can see what it is. That's upside down. <laughs> what does it say there? Use high point, gear, high point gear loop, then it's got some US Army spec. And in the bottom it says Timken Detroit Axle Company. I'm shaking too much. <laughs> I finally got it all nicely cleaned up. So now I'm going to give it a coat of my Hammerite direct to rust metal paint. No need to prime or undercoat it says on the tin
I've been using this stuff for a long time. And I'm really happy with it. I don't think it's available in a place like the States. It's originally a UK product, I think. I suspect it's very similar to the POR or POR 15 that you get in the States, I think. I could be wrong. So I'm going to give this thing two coats of paint. Let that dry. And then I'm going to wait for a strong fellow to come and visit me. <laughs> to help me turn it over so I can do the other side. Because I tell you, this thing is freaking heavy. There's no chance in hell that I will be able to turn it over. Unless I wheel it out to my gantry and use the chain block to hoist it. Very rusty, I tell you. Some sweat, followed by a lick of paint, and they are as good as new again. Yes, there's dust and rust and yellow paint everywhere. What a cock job, eh? <laughs> You gotta make a noise, then it's easier. <laughs> 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 That freaking nut is now seized up and it's refusing to budge. So I think it's time to call in some heavier artillery. <laughs> Take that. That's not too <laughs> Who's the boss now? <laughs> Let's see what happens. I don't know how heavy it is. Oh, no, man. Piece I'm of shape. <laughs> you mean this is the easy part? Okay, we lift it. Then, well, let's start. Let's. Wait, this seems to make. Yeah. Ooh, careful. Okay. Okay, okay. And then take it out. No, no leave it there. Just take, let's just take this piece of shit off here. Yeah. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Right. And two, three. Oh. Wait, wait there. Okay. I'll just come around to help you. And just see. Yeah. My seconds. muscles are not that strong anymore. <laughs> and even say that. I've become a weak thing. They're old muscles. Okay, wait. Right. Well, I've got a, yeah. Are you giving me the light side? Oh, nice. Uh, thanks. <laughs> oh, God. Two, three. and scrubbing and cleaning. So that's as far as we can go for now. I'm waiting for those back springs to be refurbished. I've also sent in the wheel cylinders to a company here and what they actually do is they bore them out and install a uh, stainless steel sleeve and then they put new rubber seals, refurbish the thing completely 
and make it better than new man and they can do any shape and any size so that's quite awesome so yeah thanks for hanging out with us out here in the forest we enjoyed your company oh and uh, you guys in the states or the us happy thanksgiving man i'll see you all in the next video until then have a lack of one man <laughs>